Hello, I'm Chris and I work with a lot of Halloween props and costuming. A product that I use quite often is this Dragon Skin product by Smooth On. Uh, this specifically is Dragon Skin FX Pro. For a long time I've been really curious about how much abuse it can actually take. What's the strength of the product? The Smooth On manual rates it at 61 PLA, that's pounds per linear inch. It's a great technical rating, but what does it mean in the real world? How much can this take before it, it gives out? You know, how much stretch can it give? Uh, how much force will it take? That's what I'm going to test out today. I've got this uh, Green Lantern mask that I uh, used for a costume a couple years back. And uh, silicone, uh, Dragon Skin FX Pro. So it's the exact same product as we're looking at here. Uh, it's not terribly thick. Uh, the thickest point is maybe a centimeter. Uh, the thinnest point is going to be through the nose where it goes down to maybe a quarter to a half a centimeter up through the, uh, the bridge right between the eyebrows here. So that's probably where this would give when it does. I've strapped it up so that I don't have any uh, uh, you know, obvious pressure points at the edges. Uh, the hook may just rip through because it's a, a finer uh, metal shaft. I'm hoping the straps will get a better grab on there and distribute that force so that we can see where, uh, and where it'll tear and how much force it'll take through the center. Okay, I have everything set up here. I'm going to uh, anchor the, the lower strap with my foot and uh, we're going to see what this can take. And uh, I think the elongation at breakage is supposed to be about 763%. Uh, so, you know, we, we may get the mask up to about here, you know, somewhere in this area before it gives out. And this, uh, this is quite hard to stretch beyond this at this point. We're at 17 pounds. I'm holding this with both hands so that my hand doesn't smash into the ceiling when it finally gives out. We're at 25 pounds. That's about where we figured the mask would stretch to. Well, we got to about 27 pounds before it finally gave out, and it did tear uh, from the end where a uh, strap was, well, not where the strap was holding it, but close to it, uh, through the edge of the, or the bottom of the eye there. So that got to about 27 pounds of force. Uh, you saw how far it stretched. It's pretty close to what uh, they they rated at in the book at 763%. Uh, that's, that took a lot of muscle to, to break this. You know, it was not, not easy to pull this apart. You know, once the tear is there, it's, it's going to tear a lot easier. But uh, if I were to even take this with my hands, I'm going to try to break through right around there and see yeah, it's tearing from the center here a little bit. Yeah, it, it takes a lot. Uh, you're not going to break this under normal use unless you're doing something really crazy with it. But I uh, hope you enjoyed the test. Hope it was useful to whatever you're working on. And we'll see you next time.